Today, we will try to unlocking cosmic mysteries, the truth about God, good, and the shadows in between. Hash viral insights with a, a small, interiating story. Nilgiris Baduga's 2050 vision and Ramesh Kakan's soothing videos, creating a powerful synergy for the holistic mindfulness. Explore how this blend enhances individual well-being, fosters community development, and aligns with a balanced, purposeful lifestyle. Join the journey to harmonious living, hash harmony unleashed, hash Nilgiris vision, 2050. Today's the undiscovered question. Is opposite to God like evil, anything exit? Envision Nilgiris, we will see, can we improve Nilgiris people business skills worldwide? Establishing a platform for commerce and trade, connecting Badaga entrepreneurs and businesses for economic growth. In a bustling university, a professor stands before his class, a question poised at his lips. Did God create everything that exists? He asks. A student, confident in his response, asserts, yes, he did. The professor, with a sly grin, retorts, so God created evil too. According to principle, our actions define us. Thus, by your logic, God is evil. The room falls silent. The professor, content, believes he has once again debunked the myth of God. But then, another student rises, asking, Professor, may I pose a question? Of course, the professor replies, intrigued. The student inquires, Professor, does cold exist? Of course it does. Haven't you felt the chill of winter? The professor retorts, amusement rippling through the room. Actually, sir, cold doesn't exist. The student calmly counters. According to physics, cold is merely the absence of heat. Absolute zero is the complete absence of heat. We've simply created the term cold to describe the sensation of heat's absence. The student continues, querying. Sir, does darkness exist? Certainly, the professor answers, but the student corrects him again. You're mistaken, sir. Darkness does not exist. It's simply the absence of light. We can study light, break it into colors, yet we can't measure darkness. Darkness is just a term we use to describe the absence of light. Finally, the student asks, Sir, does evil exist? Undoubtedly, the professor responds. We witness cruelty, crime, violence every day. These are manifestations of evil. No, sir, the student corrects him for the final time. Evil doesn't exist by itself. It's merely the absence of God. God doesn't create evil. Evil is the result of the absence of godly love in human hearts. It's like cold, which emerges in the absence of heat, or darkness, which appears in the absence of light. In this conversation, we've explored the nature of God, the concept of evil, and their interplay in our world. The debate about whether God is good or evil, whether he creates evil or whether evil is simply the absence of his presence, is an enduring one. But one thing is clear. Our understanding of these concepts of good, evil, light and darkness is shaped by our perspective. It's a reminder that sometimes the absence of something can be just as powerful as its presence. Encouraging our people to avoid harmful habits is crucial for our collective well-being and progress. Fostering a vision like the vision, the Nilgiri's 2050 inches, requires a united effort to shape a positive future. Conclusion Thank you for watching by Ramesh Kakan. Your engagement, comments, shares, and subscriptions contribute to spreading awareness about the Vision Nilgiri's 2050 initiatives. Together, Let's build a community dedicated to positive change.